Uganda's coffee exports are paying off. Coffee shipments increased to over 240,000 bags from 200,000 bags last November season, a rise of 13.2%. The government says favorable weather was behind the rise. Exporters say it was a profitable coffee season. Although the prices were a bit low because of the international market uh, is a bit lower right now, uh, mainly due to the international commodity prices, not only of coffee but other commodities as well are at the lowest uh, for last 13 years. Uh, but yes, uh, quantity wise we uh, did fairly good. Coffee is Uganda's biggest source of foreign revenue and the government plans to maintain strict adherence to the quality of the coffee bean in order to increase earnings. The drop in global coffee prices had earlier meant low earnings, but a weakening local currency helped save farmers from anticipated losses. The cost of production in Uganda is very high for the coffee, but it's still uh, the, 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 the depreciation of ceiling to US dollar helped a lot and uh, somehow farmer was getting almost uh, equivalent to what he was getting one year back when the prices were higher. Uganda recently surpassed Ethiopia to become Africa's largest exporter of coffee, selling it to mostly the European Union, Sudan and the US. December exports are projected to be even more. This despite earlier warnings of El Nino rains that are expected to negatively impact production mainly in the long run. The upturn in coffee exports in the month of November followed good weather at the start of the season. Coffee experts say this favored the ripening and flowering of coffee, leading to increase in shipment. Exporters hope heavy rains do not interrupt coffee production in the coming months. Isabel Nakiria, CCTV, Kampala.